Hello again, viewers. Got some very, very sad news from Amsterdam. You probably know what's coming. Give you wonder. The sun has come out today, viewers, but check this out. The bag is ready. Oh dear. What a beautiful city Amsterdam is. Um, I've been very, very impressed with it. A lot nicer than I expected. I've walked to so many nice areas, um, seen a lot of nice places. I will come back maybe one day um, next year. We'll see viewers. Let's take a wee walk. I'm going to the central uh, train station. We'll walk down this way. We'll walk, we'll walk down a few side streets. We'll wait and see. We've got some sad news. I'll tell you that in a wee minute. On a more serious note, about 10 minutes ago, I was actually in a very, very sad place. I've done a wee video for you outside the Anne Frank house. Um, if you come to Amsterdam, I'm going to recommend at least popping by and just seeing it outside. Um, quite a sad story and didn't really expect it, but when I was outside it and thinking everything that went on there, um, you might get quite emotional, so don't be surprised about that. Um, to book it, online you have to book it, it's a big queue to get in. The original diaries are either in the house or in the museum. If you don't, obviously if anyone doesn't know the Anne Frank story, it's pretty tragic. 761 days hiding in the attic from the Germans. You'll see the exact house. Anyway, that's coming to the channel soon, uh, viewers. So, really, really enjoyed my time in Amsterdam. Um, Wonderful city. If you're on Facebook, check out Facebook, Scotsman in Tenerife. Posted a few videos last night showing you where I was. I ended up, after doing the videos, watching another bad Liverpool performance in the, the sports cafe. Satellite sports cafe. Seven euros for a pint of Heineken, in case you're wondering. Then I moved to the second half because I couldn't get a phone charged. I moved to the Hoopman bar. And uh, the beer went up to eight euros for a pint a Pilsner. Is it called Swink or something? It was nice. It's quite nice. Um, then after that, I went to the Waterhole, which quite a few viewers recommended. My dad recommended it as well. The random Irish pub there. So many wee bakeries and cake shops. On the way home last night, I went into a wee baker's around the corner from the hostel. They did ice donut, and I went to the checkout. And uh, the guy's like, ah, it's six euros for a donut. And I was like, ah, no thanks. He just laughed. He says, I know, it's shocking. <laughs> he was even laughing at the prices. I mean, six, six euros for a donut. It's not cheap, Amsterdam, I tell you that. Um, so I left that. And uh, after the Central Sports Cafe, we went to the piano bar. Now, I've got a, I've got a wee story about that on another video. Something outrageous happened in there. <laughs> You've seen another video, viewers. Check this guy out. Um, so where I was staying last night in that area, I really enjoyed it. Uh, the hostel was brand new, no complaints about it, I got a good sleep in it. Um, there was oh, three other people in the room. Uh, had a brief chat with a couple of them. Everybody's quite friendly. If you want an English breakfast, I found you a place. Look, we're covering everything in this one, culture, tapas. But they also do an English breakfast in here. Bacon and eggs, 11.50. I tell you, for Amsterdam, that's not that bad. Uh, but we want a full English breakfast, it's going to be a wee bit more by the time you add things on. Omelette for my mum, 12 euros. Head down this way. Trams all over the place. Uh, cyclists rule this city. Bikes everywhere. You'll do well not to get knocked down on a regular basis. But what a wonderful city. Um, a great vibe. Everybody having a nice time. Chilled and relaxed. Um, yes, it is more expensive than quite a lot of places I've been, but it's, it's, I would go as far as saying it's one of the best places I've visited. I've only been here two days. I've missed a lot of places, thanks for all the recommendations. They've still got some videos coming up on the channel, you're going to see them. Train station just over there, and um, that gives you a wee clue what the sad news is. Um, there's some videos coming up on the channel anyway, I hope you find interest in some different areas in Amsterdam. The plan is, we'll see how there's another place, English breakfast. Um, the plan is, maybe, I'll see how the videos do. The videos have not been doing well, I'm afraid. That's kind of half the reason I'm leaving today as well. It's not a personal decision, more a business decision. Um, because to stay here in a couple of days, I was also thinking I get the train down to Brussels. But, 
there's a couple of things that I decided just not to go for it. It's lovely here, isn't it? I tell you, um, Dutch people are hardcore, they sit out in anything. It's warmer today, but it's still not that warm. But any hint of the sun coming out, people just sit outside here. Um, last night it was below freezing, and there was people sitting outside pubs. I couldn't believe it. Let's continue across, yours. Oh, oh, need to wait 15 seconds. Um, yeah, I couldn't believe it last night. People sitting out, outside, unbelievable. So, yeah, uh, the Masters Golf start tomorrow, and I was thinking if I go to Brussels, I know what's going to happen. I'm going to end up just finding a bar and sit and watch the golf, and it's going to cost a fair amount of money, and I'm not going to get that many videos done. And I looked at the videos I've done here so far, I've not done that many, maybe in total, maybe 20. Um, but I looked at the videos and how they're performing. And I just want to thank everybody who's watched the videos. Okay, can you hear what's this for? That's for the canal cruises. They're roughly about 12, 13 euros these canal cruises. I've seen them advertised everywhere. Much the same price. Um, yeah, I just want to thank everybody who's watched the Amsterdam videos. I really appreciate it. Something different for the channel uh, from my normal videos. Uh, not been doing very well, I'm afraid. One video's doing quite well, the rest of them not doing that well. So I had to think about that. And I thought, I could stay here another day or two, do more videos. But it's probably not going to be a good uh, decision for me, I'm afraid. But what I'm planning, maybe of yours, is a cruise here, look. Hugh goes all the way down there as well. Um, what I'm planning, maybe next year, I'll do a wee day trip in Amsterdam, going somewhere else maybe. Maybe combine it, Amsterdam, Brussels, Paris, something like that. Because um, I think for these set of destinations, it might be better for me just to do a day trip. Just do as many videos as I can. So the sad news is, my trip in Amsterdam is almost coming to an end. Um, I've really enjoyed visiting a different place. The weather at night has been absolutely Baltic. It's quite nice today, but the weather at night um, has been cold. If you're coming here in April, be prepared uh, to bring warm clothing. Not that busy that cruise. Most of the cruises are really busy. Look, all the people, all the people just sitting outside, chilling out. I can only imagine what it's like in the summer here when the weather's actually really good. The sun is out today, to be fair. Um, it's not that hot, but the sun's out. Just a wonderful city. I um, would highly recommend it if you're thinking of doing a city break and you've got the budget, of course, because you're going to... I don't even know how much the spirit was. I was tempted last night to get a vodka and coke just to see how much it would cost me. But then I thought, no, that's going to be a 15 euro job, probably. <laughs> so I had a few pints, not too many, but back to the hostel, 2 o'clock, piano bars open to 3 but didn't stay at 3, 2 o'clock, back to the hostel, and I slept about half past 8 this morning, that's pretty good for a hostel, sleeping that, that amount of time. Hold well on viewers, my jacket's tied around my waist and it's falling down, disaster. If you're new to the channel, do me a wee favour, hit the wee subscribe button, it's absolutely free, I'd really appreciate if you if you consider subscribing, it's free. But 70% of people are not subscribed and it doesn't cost a penny. You'll get a wee notification if you click the bell when I upload new videos. Occasionally I'll do a live video. I don't know if you caught the one in Glasgow Airport. Um, I don't think the signal was that great in that pub. I don't know what the picture's like, quality. I might do a wee Q&A. Maybe another time soon. We we'll might see I'm going to run, run out of videos again. In the next few weeks, what you can expect is Amsterdam videos. I'll run out of them soon, and then you'll maybe get a couple from Ibiza. And then my next trip is planned on the 15th of April. That's the plan, viewers. I can't, I can't guarantee it'll happen, but that's the plan. And hopefully this month as well, we'll also be in another new destination. Maybe somewhere you don't expect. We'll wait and see. I don't know if I can go down these steps to the metro. It's five euros ninety and the train to the airport take about fifteen minutes. So this is getting filmed. I think we're now past midday. My flight's at two fifty with EasyJet. I'll do another video to just telling you about the costings on this trip. It's been an expensive one between the flights. The, the hostel accommodation's been cheap, thirty eight pounds for both nights. Um, spent quite a lot of money actually. I don't, I don't know what I spent the money on. I spent about two hundred euros in two days. I've not been drinking that much. It's pretty easy to spend money here, to be fair. Quite busy around here. We hot dog stands, crepe stands. 
If you're a foodie, you'll absolutely love Amsterdam. There's so many different places. You see people queuing outside for a lot of places as well. They're really popular. The wee cafe restaurant over there. Amsterdam Central. Okay viewers, I need to head in here and I need to get the dreaded train to the airport. Sad to be leaving but it's been a great city to visit. Um, thanks so much for your support watching the videos. I really, really appreciate it. I hope you watch the rest of the videos that are to come on the, the channel. Um, my thoughts on Amsterdam. Um, absolutely brilliant city. Thanks for all the recommendations I've got as well. Gary, thanks for your recommendations if you're watching as well. <laughs> um, yeah. Thanks for the recommendations. I'll hopefully be back next year doing a wee day trip. Um, can't speak highly enough of it. Absolutely brilliant. But it's time to head to the airport, viewers. Very, very sad news. Thanks so much for all your support. Um, it means a lot to me. And I need to figure out where to buy tickets here. I think you can buy them online, you save a euro. If you get a ticket, they charge you a euro for a disposable ticket. But, eh... Uh, We'll wait and see if I wander about. I'll check to see when the trains are coming. There's a board up there, let's see. I'm on my old phone here, so the quality might not be great, unfortunately, in darker places. Okay, 12.11. I don't know when the next one is. I remember you get that 12.11. I think I missed that, probably. Yeah, 12.11, I missed that. Missed the train. Nothing unusual, viewers. <laughs> we'll see when the next one is. Alright, thanks for watching viewers, really appreciate all your support and I'll see you on the next one. It's goodbye from Amsterdam. <laughs>